Tom and I are looking at using new or emerging technologies to uh, find new or more interesting ways to digitize cultural heritage. And, and with that digitization, trying to make it more of an evocative representation that better captures the essence of the work of art. We were looking around at all of the incredible objects that are out there, um, and there are some fantastic objects in the collection. And really just thinking about what sort of objects are in here that people would like to see, that at the moment there isn't like a good accessible way to see them. We definitely wanted to get a variety of objects as well to see which kind of techniques worked better for different material types, uh, for different mediums, and for, I suppose, different dimensionalities. So we wanted to have some really three-dimensional objects, some more two-dimensional objects, and I guess what we might call two-and-a-half-dimensional objects, such as a painting surface, which has that kind of impasto uh, texture, but isn't necessarily three-dimensional, strictly speaking. We were really looking to push the boundaries of what's possible in digitization and find mm -hmm. new ways using new or emerging technologies to express an object in different ways to what has previously been done. I think it's about trying to find a digital representation that's actually evocative, that feels like you're looking at a work of art and something that you can appreciate rather than an awful facsimile or something really flat and dull. I think we want to make it look like you get to experience it as though you're in the gallery seeing it for real.